entered the Plumbing Business Success Zone, teaching entrepreneurs the business of plumbing. This is Potty Talk Live, recorded live on Facebook every week. Type 5 in the comments to subscribe to the show. And now your host, Richard Bainey, the Million Dollar Plumber. Hey, 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 plumbing pros, welcome to the 252nd episode of Potty Talk Live. I'm your host, Richard Bainey, the Million Dollar Plumber. Coming at you live, seated behind the golden MDP microphone, where we're talking the business of plumbing. And hey, and I have a great workshop edition for you tonight, where I'm going to share with you the one number, okay? The one number, the only number that you need. One is the loneliest number that you ever, you know, yeah. the only number, okay? And it ain't lonely. All right, it's very powerful, okay? <laughs> the one number that you can run your plumbing business with. So, okay. so stick around. I'm, um, it, I, I'm actually a little, I'm, I'm a little nervous. You know, I get asked, hey, sweetheart, how you doing, doing, baby? I'm doing great. Okay, yeah. you know, I get, I, are you nervous doing this kind of, you know, talking in front of people? I, I don't never get nervous. Get nervous I, I'm actually a little nervous tonight because really? I want, I, I'm just not the best teacher, mm -hmm. okay? I just, you know, you know, we all have our gifts and skills right. and that kind of stuff. You have lots of really good gifts. Okay. <laughs> Teaching is not one of them. Okay. Or spelling. Okay. <laughs> or spelling. Or, or adding. Mm -hmm. Or uh, I got pretty, th you know, a lot of things I'm not good at. No, um, not true. But this, so the teaching thing, this is mm -hmm. one, this number will literally, it changed my life. Okay. Very this life? number wow. is the difference between you being a, a, you know, being able to operate freely with your plumbing mm -hmm. business, be able to operate anywhere in the world and know right now, hmm. am I making money? Am I making okay. money? All okay. right. So we're all, I can't wait to get at it here. So, okay. hey, how you doing? All right. Hey, welcome. Doing? Welcome to the show here. Welcome. Yeah. To, if you're part of the live social audience, type live in the comments. Please type live. Live. Mm -hmm. Or if you're watching replay, type replay. Mm -hmm. Let us know you're watching the replay. Yeah. Okay. Also type when you say you're live, mm -hmm. where you're watching from. That okay. That would be great because we've got a lot of new viewers um, All right. tuning yeah. in. So we'd love to hear where you're from. And speaking of that, um, if you are a new viewer and you want to get notified when Potty Talk goes Potty Talk Live goes live. Huh? Which, what can I do? Which, why wouldn't you? Right. Um, all you have to do is tap on the screen. If you're watching on your mobile, tap on the screen. And you'll have three little dots up in the upper right-hand corner. And it, make sure you follow, follow the Million Dollar Plumber. But then also um, type get live notifications. I think that's where it's at. So do that right now because you don't want to miss it. Ever. Don't want to miss ever. it. All right. Hey, and if you listen to the podcast... As always, you know what to do. Mm -hmm. Just keep on listening. We love having you on the podcast listening. as well. Mm -hmm. So, hey, also yes. share this. This is a night. Okay? That's a good this, one. Is, this is not self-serving. Mm -hmm. All right. If you truly hey, care for another plumbing business owner, others mm -hmm. out there, right. okay, and, and you, you want their life to be hey, free and you, you want their life to be better, yes. share this. Share with it them. right okay. now. That's a, great, okay? that's a great thing. Share with, with anybody you know. Um, tag somebody. Share it with someone. Um, even do a watch party. If you're in some of the other plumbing groups, um, plumbing Facebook groups, right? Do a watch party. That this would this be is awesome. the number because because what we're going to go over here mm -hmm. is not it's not taught. Okay, right. in fact, the opposite hey, is taught. See. Okay, um, and it's stuff that just gets you. You don't even need to know. Okay, all, right. all this other other crap. Here and in fact, it can be you know it, it, you just don't need to know it. Now you're going to learn it and you get to know it because you're around it. But it, it doesn't it doesn't tell you anything. Anyways, right. yes. I, I can't wait to share this with you. And hope yes. it comes across right. So let us know if you shared it or if you started right. a watch party. We'd love okay. to hear about that. Any and you, all you guys are in the different groups. I know yep. there's a million plumbing groups out there. Um, hopefully you're in the ones that talk business as opposed to stupid. Just stuff. talking plumbing and showing. Right. Yeah, look, showing. look what I pulled out of the toilet. Oh, okay, <laughs> all right, all right, okay. Uh, but yeah, we're talking business here, and yeah. this is mm -hmm. the number. Okay, is. this is the thing mm -hmm. again that uh, literally, 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 okay, mm -hmm. I'm sitting on a beach, mm -hmm. okay, and you can look in mm -hmm. and see this one number, and it's like, hey, I'm making money, okay, yeah. all right, you don't need to know all this, you don't need to know all this other stuff, mm -hmm. hey, all, the, all this other stuff is just smoke and mirrors <laughs> and to make others sound smart, right. okay, um, and we're not about that. Hey, Jesse. I'm not about this. <laughs> right, right, right. And I came up with this because I wasn't smart. I didn't want to do I want to do all this other crap. And I'll, I'll explain that. And that's part of why I'm a little nervous. I'm going to be transparent here. Okay. okay? Wait, I need you say hi, Jesse, from live from Raleigh, North Carolina. He's hey. following the instructions very well. Thanks, Jesse. All right, Jesse. Welcome. welcome. Mm -hmm. okay. Raleigh, and North what? Carolina. Mm -hmm. Okay. And so, hey, question for you. Yes. Talk. What's your favorite KPI? 
your key favorite performance cable. indicator. There's so many. Or what do you think is important? From. Okay, <laughs> I, want, I want you to write that down in the comments. Give you me your favorite and why why you think that's impotent. 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 Okay. Okay. Why why you think that's important? Let's okay. Mm -hmm. So give me give me your favorite KPI. Okay. Okay. Are we, okay. What if someone doesn't know what a KPI is? All right, Elizabeth. I like. I'm looking at some comments here. Okay. What's a, 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 well, I'm going to say Elizabeth. Uh -huh. I feel. Uh, I can feel my toes in the sand. Oh, freedom. Freedom. And that this means. This is what well, I'm going to share with you tonight. <laughs> it's going to get you that freedom. Okay. And the freedom, not just to be able to get away, but the freedom of mind. Mm, okay. Mm -hmm. The freedom of just ease. Right. Of That's knowing what's mean. going. The freedom of knowing what's going on. Actually, going on in your plumbing business. Mm -hmm. Okay. Or more, you know, your business that right. asset. Right now, mm -hmm. what's going on right now? This very second. within two, you know, within a sixty seconds. Mm -hmm. You know, by the time it takes you to get to it and pull mm -hmm. up, whatever, you know, up and okay, I, I know exactly what's happening mm -hmm. with my plumbing business right now, right now which is second. ultimately what we want to know: Am I making money? Right. Okay. All right. Um, so because it's not a hobby. It ain't a, ain't a hobby. It's okay. Not a hobby. Nor do, nor do I want to spend all my time on this other stuff. Right. So what do we have? We have anybody listening to KPIs? Nope. Nobody has listed any KPIs favorite KPI. KPIs is a key performance indicator. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. So yep. oh, let me go ahead. I, I got hey, my, Johnny, my board some... up here. Mm -hmm. Okay. How does that look? It looks all right. awesome. Look like it looks fancy here. Yeah. Okay. It looks amazing. But you know, so you got your KPIs. Got your okay. KPIs. Okay. KPIs are, are stuff like, um, you know, well, revenues. Okay. 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 I like revenue. Okay. I'm a fan. Revenue, all right. My, so, my so, peeps, so we look in the house. All right, all right. Dubs. DW's in, okay. Mm -hmm. Your revenues, um, a plus or minus percent over previous period. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, TK just um, said what his favorite KPI what? is. TK, TK, who we got to meet um, downtown Indianapolis at the Wet Show. It's awesome. There's a good. Okay. TK, book job. Hey, hey TK, that's one. Mm -hmm. Right, book. Mm -hmm. Okay. Book jobs. Um, you know, book jobs. Okay. My peep. Uh, I'll, pick, I'll pick calls here, okay? okay? But that's along the same kind of line, you know, book jobs and that mm -hmm. kind of stuff. Okay. okay, and if you notice, I'm going to start going here okay. with the KPIs, all right? And we look we look at these things, we get wrapped up in these things. When I, you know, even though I'm, uh, okay, I, I made, you know, I got $10,000, mm -hmm. but am I making money? Did I make mm -hmm. money? Just knowing that I have $10,000, $10, did I make money? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Well, my materials were 12000 Is that right. a problem? Well, that, that's another, okay? Ooh, uh, materials percentage, mm -hmm. okay, even. What Dub they says. Are, and mater a material percentage. You know, guys, guys, you know, my materials, I got, I got materials of, you know, are, you know, a 24%, 24% mm -hmm. of revenues. Okay. Am I making money? money. Okay, average ticket. Average that's a, ticket. That's another Dub. one. Okay, mm -hmm. thank you. Thanks, DW. All right, average tick. Okay, mm -hmm. you know, and guys, guys will get all we all get all wrapped up in this. Okay, we we got to know our average tickets three hundred forty nine dollars. We're going to raise it to eight hundred dollars. We got to get eleven hundred. I got eleven hundred. I got you know, give me twelve. Got to be twelve. Give me twelve. Give me twelve. Whatever. <laughs> whatever. <laughs> Am I making money? Uh -huh. Okay, we get all. Uh, you see, see, I'm, I'm leaning towards this. You see, okay. where, see where we're headed here. Mm -hmm. We get all wrapped up in these KPIs and and you know all of, all of our you know these. We, we, we got the dials and all the graphs and Dial. all the stuff telling us, you know, what our average ticket is. And we can spit mm -hmm. out, okay, am I making money? Mm -hmm. Your overhead, your percentage yes. of overhead. That's, yep. that's another, Expenses, that's a K, right? KPI. No, that's What's, mm -hmm. you know, um, your overhead percentage. And I would bet, Jesse, okay. that's not your favorite because overhead sucks. Overhead, right. <laughs> <laughs> but that's what is like my, my um, overhead expense to, to sales, you know, is, is 60%. Mm -hmm. And... You know, as well as, I don't, I hear that's not good. Okay. Well, why is it not? Rumor why? has it. Am I making money? Mm -hmm. Am I making money? Okay. okay. Knowing my overhead percentage mm -hmm. or even what I'm spending on overhead. Right. I, am I making money? You know, what, what are some of the other things, you know, the, the, the closing We've got a percentage? Couple other, mm -hmm. Let's see. Johnny, Johnny's got one. Missed hours. Closing percentage. All right, Johnny. Johnny. Is that my Johnny? <laughs> that's your there, Johnny. There's my KPI that's your guy. Johnny. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. Closing percentage is a biggie. You mm -hmm. know, guys, we're, well, you know, I'm, I'm at 70% closing. I'm 80% closing percentage. Nine, I'm, like, I'm, I'm a 110% closing, you know, percentage. Mm -hmm. Am I making money? Mm -hmm. Okay. What, what, what was it? What was uh, Johnny's? Johnny, um, Johnny said missed hours. Yeah. yeah missed hours. Mm -hmm. Okay. Lance says, are my guys performing? Right. Performance okay. indicators. M missed, missed hours. Mm -hmm. Okay. 
I, you know, we, we didn't close on these, these hours. Supposedly, if my average was, you know, I'm, I'm selling jobs for three hours, you know, that's my average. Okay. Mm -hmm. And so that means the jobs I'm not doing, that's, that's three hours. That's lost opportunity. Mm -hmm. Am I making money? Um, Toby okay. Mercener. Hopefully okay. I pronounced that right. ROI. Oops, where'd it go? Right. ROI on marketing. On new uh, are on new, new projects he said okay so are a new project so new construction I'm gonna new, say, okay new construction yeah. okay and uh. toby, I, don't, I think I said Todd but it's Toby Toby where are you where are you out of I don't recognize your name where um, where are you calling in from here we go Toby mm -hmm. hey that's why ROI that's return on investment mm -hmm. which ROI is those initials that's thrown on of a lot of the things what's mm -hmm. what's my ROI on the van Mm. What's what's the ROI on my guys, right. on my labor, yeah. okay, on you know on the, on the project ROI? My ROI was eighteen percent mm -hmm. or twelve percent mm -hmm. or five percent or what? Okay. Am I making money? Mark Fleming says right. I am making money. Okay. All right. <laughs> right. <laughs> right. I want to know. Mm, of course you. Are. So it, so the back in the day, back okay, in before, the day. Mm. Um, you know, we were all at that like stage. Okay. Where we, we get into our plumbing business, mm -hmm. okay? We all we all been been here, okay? okay? And because we're pretty good at plumbing, we start a plumbing you know plumbing company. Instead of making that guy money, I'm gonna make me money, right? Mm -hmm. In some form or another, okay. and we get out there and we start our plumbing business. Okay. You know, we're gonna take over the plumbing world. Hey, Toby's out of Buffalo, Buffalo, okay. New York. I'm assuming. Hey, Buffalo, Toby. All right, nice welcome. To have you. And so mm -hmm. we, we get out there and we think, well, okay, we got, I got the accountant and my accountant's telling me like my revenue's percentage of this. My call, my call, my call, you know, closing ratio is this, and my my labor should be this and that. And I, but you know, you know, so we, we had those kind of conversations. Right. I actually about finally about four years in, I said, I don't know something. Right. I, I don't know the, the business. It is the business. Okay, I'm a pretty, I'm a really good plumber. Yep. But I didn't, I didn't know the business of the plumbing. That's okay. True. The hey, business. Rick, Rick has, Hudson wants to know if we can see you. Actually, we can't see you, but we see your comments. Yeah. All right. <laughs> He's out on YouTube. So. Okay. Yep. <laughs> and so we, um, and so I, I brought in, a, you know, there wasn't anyone like the million dollar plumber and mm -hmm. that kind of thing. Um, ROI at, at high percentage. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right. Okay. Mm -hmm. So even, okay, I got 100% ROI. Am I making money? Okay. Right. Am I, where am I at? Okay. Hey, Alex Marks. Can I really pay the bills after I pay, you know, can, can I pay, um, you uh, know, um, my, salary. My, my salary in the labor mm -hmm. after I've paid all this stuff off? Okay. Right. Mm -hmm. Well, as I brought this, I, I got, hey, I, Danny, Danny. I wound up, I knew a guy, it was a CFO, a chief financial officer, he was older, mm -hmm. and I just retired. I, I retired, and I just begged him mm -hmm. to teach me business. <laughs> And so I wound up paying them mm -hmm. um, to, to teach me business. And so, of course, they run me through all, all this KPI stuff. We figured out the business and you know, KPIs and set this up. Right. But as I'm looking at this stuff, first of all, this stuff can be, and guys, I, I'll, I'll admit, I'm not the sharpest tool mm -hmm. in the shed, okay? <laughs> and so I'm not going to speak for you, but I'm not the sharpest tool in the shed. So that's why I'm a little being, being transparent here okay. is that I, I didn't want, you know, I was a little intimidated by this stuff. Okay, mm -hmm. and I and putting it all together at that time, it, it was like how how does this all flow together? Mm -hmm. And it seemed a little silly mm -hmm. because yes, all right, <laughs> the W says I, I can see, see you. you. <laughs> That's right. Okay, <laughs> at, at the time, mm -hmm. uh, also it, I didn't. It told me after the fact. It's like, but so I, it did me no good to find out. You know, a month later. Mm -hmm. You know, as you look at your PL and look at this stuff, right? Okay, mm -hmm. that you know, where, you lost. What, and what the percentage meant, mm -hmm. but I didn't, I wasn't making money, right? And, and, the, and the game now is, you do. is to make money, right? Okay, is to make money, mm -hmm. and I want to know sooner whether I'm making money or not so that I can make decisions, right? You know, so you know, what, whether I, how I give some back on this job or if mm -hmm. I do this. Or you know it's it's Tuesday or Wednesday and I got payroll coming up. Right. Am I gonna have enough to pay the bills and mm -hmm. make it, like we said, pay the salary? Right. Am, am I making money? Right. And I want to know at eleven you know eleven a.m. Mm -hmm. in the morning on Wednesday what if I'm, I'm on, if I'm on track? Mm -hmm. Okay. Where where I stand? <laughs> well, of course. Then what we, what you could do is you go through all these KPIs. Right. Okay, mm -hmm. so they so they had me start doing where I okay, well look at your revenue and you know, take you take your calls and, and your materials. Well let's take a look at it. Okay. Mm -hmm. what, what you had started doing, mm -hmm. well you look at your sales, right? Okay. So right. so if you're now now what you do, if you want to know am I making money, where do I actually stand? This is the process you gotta go through. Mm -hmm. Okay. 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 Let's hear it. 
All right, you got to figure your sales, right? Okay. So you take a look at, well, we did that, you know, $6,000 tankless job, mm -hmm. and we did this, you know, you add it up, and okay, we're sitting at, you know, $11,500 $11, or something, whatever okay. it is, okay? Right. But am I making money? Oh. Okay, I know that came in, okay, but, you know, and I had, but, but can I pay the bills, okay? Right. Well, I got, well, we got to look, okay, what's my materials, mm. right? Mm -hmm. So how much do I have in materials? against against those sales right, right. So, I, so i gotta go figure that out mm -hmm. okay uh, well like I, I paid the guy right there's labor labor right <sighs> payroll so i gotta figure up payroll he worked this out they said they turned mm -hmm. in this hours well i didn't even turn in their hours yet so i gotta call you know hey joe how, how long do you work over on this job you didn't turn this you know that that, mm -hmm. that kind of stuff okay mm -hmm. all right, right. You gotta figure out labor um and that's the plumber. Oh, but I also have a helper that I've going around. Did, oh, did we? Yeah. Did we have Johnny? <laughs> Sorry, Johnny. I'm Johnny. So Joey. She's Joey. another. Okay. Joey we, the helper. Joey the helper. Mm -hmm. In fact, our, our helper was Sam. It's mm -hmm. all you, Sam. Sam. Okay. Mm -hmm. We have Sam on the job. Is Sam going to? What? Mm -hmm. That's all part of it, right? You know. Yep. So you know we got the help. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. What else we have here? Um, subs. Mm -hmm. You know, if we were doing part one, there's a dig job. What was the hey, sub? David. You know, what what they mm -hmm. charge us? That mm -hmm. that kind of stuff. Okay. I, mean, got, I got to get all this information to truly know if I made money. Right. I'm, I'm going through. I'm going through all these cal calisthenics. Then yep. there's the other expenses, guys. Have met, you know, there's other expenses that you've mentioned. How about taxes? Um, right. I haven't got that. Boo taxes. All right, taxes. No, don't pay the but taxes. But expenses. You know, the fuel, <laughs> um, the CSR. That's their side. I mean, that's all built into that. When right. you're, you know, 11 a.m. on Wednesday. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, to whether or not I've, I've you know, because I got to pay those things. Right. I got to pay the rent. Mm -hmm. The rent's also due, the, you know, on my shop. Yep. Okay, that's all, that's all in here. Wait a so, second. Nobody told me all of this when I started my plumbing business. Right. I know, right. That there were all these things. Okay. What? Right. Mm -hmm. And so. Insurance. Um, Timothy says insurance. Don't forget the insurance. Right. So even, you know, e even our, you know, you know, all this stuff's in here. So I got you know, to gotta put all these things together. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then, and then finally, you know, subtract it out and figure it out, and then right. I, I can see what's left. Mm -hmm. So after a day, right. <laughs> okay, of go, going through that, mm -hmm. you know, I said, there's, there's got to be a better way. Wait, bonds, insurance, and permits. Don't forget those. Right. That, mm -hmm. That's all. There we go. I mean, Toby, you're exactly right. I mean, yep. it goes, goes on. Yep. It okay. It never stops. So it's, it's all these, all these num, all this information mm -hmm. to find out after the fact. Okay. After the fact, morning. and I'm telling, I'm telling you, I'm I I may be crazy, uh, uh, but I, but I didn't want to wait after the fact. I want to know now. Mm -hmm. Okay, and and knowing this information, sales just because something shows me what sales I did for the day, and what materials were there, and what labor, what that portion of labor, those kinds of things. Mm -hmm. I still had to add. You still have to put all that stuff together. Okay. Right. Yep. All right. Mm -hmm. And and I wanted to know now. Okay. In fact, yes. I'm just lazy. Okay. <laughs> um, also, That's I'm all about true. being. I, I wanted. There had to be a better way. Mm. Okay. I, I wanted to sit be on a beach. Way. Okay. Mm -hmm. I wanted to sit on the beach with a lovely Laura. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. And and back in the day, it wasn't yes. the phone, but you can do that now. On the phone, we have the smartphones. We do. But we but we had you know laptops, the mm -hmm. computer, mm -hmm. and so we'd sit at the pool. Mm -hmm. And I wanted to know now why the kids were playing in the pool there at Disney World. You know, at the resort, mm -hmm. I wanted to be able to look in and say, you know, are we making money and can we stay another week? <laughs> okay. And I wanted to know now, mm -hmm. um, and I wanted to get back to my, my adult beverage mm -hmm. and relaxing without spending the whole rest of the day trying to, to get all this information, mm -hmm. okay, and putting all this information together. And I knew there had to be a better way. Got to be a better way. Okay. Okay. And there is. Mm -hmm. Okay. There is. So it hit me at one mm -hmm. time. Like what's the common denominator of all this? Okay. Okay. If I could get all this information down into a number mm -hmm. that everything is associated with, a common denominator, then I can I can tie all that together, and I could it, it has a relationship to one another, mm -hmm. and I I can look at the one number. Okay. okay? And all this hat, what all this has in common mm. is time. Okay. Mm -hmm. Time. Time. Okay. So I get everything down into this common denominator 
of time. Mm -hmm. Now, okay, <laughs> Jesse no, says hi. No, no, you You're can't. You're the business do it. owner. You have to know it. You have to know this, Jesse. <laughs> nice okay? try, Jesse. <laughs> and, and certainly, what I'm going to show you right now, you need to know. Okay, mm -hmm. if you don't know this stuff yourself, you're going to wind up getting screwed, or you're 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 just someone else's boy. Mm -hmm. Okay, you're a slave. Okay, mm -hmm. you're. I'm, I'm I'm using ugly words or things because it's true. Look, you want because I want you to feel the weight of that. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. If you're looking to be um, for what we call the freedom lifestyle. Right. Okay, where you can come and go. All right. And you can, and this asset doesn't control you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, if you're looking to work in your business every day, and want to be a part, and that just really fires work you 10 up. Work twelve hours a day, and work for the rest ten, and of your just in that, then then you, you can be in all this stuff. Mm -hmm. Now, I will tell you what, what I get ready to sh share with you here today. I didn't. You'll know these things. Percentages. You know, I knew my material percentage, my labor rate. I mean, this day I was always, always around twenty four percent. Now, I didn't care. That's high. I wasn't worried about taking things. I pay thirty percent labor rate. Mm -hmm. If I was hitting what I'm getting ready to show you, right. okay, it didn't matter. I, I knew I knew where where I was at, okay. okay? Mm -hmm. But if you're looking to be free, you don't want to spend all your time. And most guys I know don't want to be a. I didn't want to be a business office guy mm -hmm. and spend all my time with this. I wanted to spend all my time next to the pool. Mm -hmm. I wanted to play, okay. I wanted to enjoy life, right? Okay, and so I wanted to find a way mm -hmm. where I could have all this information at at my fingertips. And I could know where, where I was at with one number. One okay? number. Okay. And all this information, all this, all these things are tied to time. Okay. Okay. Now let me let me be a little. Um, let me clarify here, or or suppose here a little bit. Okay. This is also mm -hmm. saying that we're talking about residential service plumbing. Okay. Mm, that's true. This kind of that's thing won't work um, with new construction right. and commercial and worn you know stuff that you can't. I mean. No. That, that's that's loosey goosey like that. Um, it, it's you, 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 it's, it's it a just difficult. Work. It, just, it just doesn't, right. work, doesn't work. Okay, so yep. this is really on the residential service service side of things. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, by the way, that's what freedom is, anyways. Mm -hmm. If you're doing new construction and commercial, even you think you're getting away, you're you're not setting yourself up for freedom. Okay, mm -hmm. you will it will come back and bite you, and um, you're not you got to be in that business. Okay, right. mm -hmm. so that's you know so we're you know. We're talking Resident residential service. That's Res what we know. That's what we teach. That's right. What we residential preach. service. Right. It's also um, supposing here mm -hmm. that you, you're doing a couple things. Okay. You know your hourly rate. Your honest hourly rate? We call it, if you're in the academy, mm -hmm. my success academy and, mm -hmm. and my private coaching and that kind of stuff, you know what we call it? We call it your honest hourly rate. Right. You got to know why you charge what you charge. Mm -hmm. Okay. Because... An honest hourly rate is not just something you pulled out of your arse or you're copying the, what you think the market will bear or mm -hmm. handle, what your customers are telling you the will and the pay, right. or you know what you know what what your competition is charging supposedly, and mm -hmm. you're going to charge a little less. You know that's that's not honest. That's yeah. dishonest. Okay. In fact, you're stealing from the customer, mm -hmm. and you're stealing from yourself. Okay. Yo, even worse. But to truly know what we call your honest hourly rate, mm -hmm. because your honest hourly rate, okay is figured by knowing what you're selling, mm -hmm. which we also will learn is you're selling time, selling not plumbing. Time. Okay, a little freebie what? there, okay? Mm -hmm. All right, you're selling time, mm -hmm. and you're putting all these expenses, all this kind of stuff built into your honest hourly rate. Mm -hmm. So all these things, this doesn't matter. This is just a little game you play, just like, well, okay, yeah, it's 24% of this, blah, 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 okay, no. All right, all this stuff, Mm -hmm. is built in here into your honest hourly rate right okay mm -hmm. so it's where i'm assuming that you're figuring up your honest hourly rate okay okay all right got it i'm also assuming, assuming yes okay mm -hmm. that you're paying your guys um the fairest way as well okay um and you're paying peace rate mm. okay charlie says at least set up the freedom to choose to work in the business if you want to not because you have to yes that's true okay yep and that's what this allows you, mm -hmm. allows you to do, okay? Hi, um, Charlie, by the way. Well, I want to get to that. I want to yes. introduce what this is, okay? okay. Hey, Charlie. Hey, yeah. Charlie. And it's assuming that you're paying your guys peace rate, mm -hmm. which, again, is based on time, on your time, okay? Right. <laughs> Not their time. Again, <laughs> when, you're paying, when you're paying a guy hourly, you can't control. That's, you know, you can't, 
you can't control that. Right. A guy's just going to sleep out in a hammock. He'll take two uh-huh. hours, four hours, eight hours, do this job a for week. whatever reason. It doesn't okay. matter. All right. right. Doesn't, but you can't. That's you're you're on. You're at his whim. His mercy. And his mercy. Yeah. Right. Lance is saying he loves right. peace rate. Peace rate. An example of peace rate mm-hmm. is now. Now you can figure you know a task up that I'll pay three hours for this water heater install for a standard water heater installation. We'll just mm-hmm. use that as an example. Sure. Okay. Okay. And so. You're, that's all built in here. Mm-hmm. There's your labor. I'm right. not paying more three hours, mm-hmm. okay, on that task. So you know, and you're paying that, okay. So now you know what the labor is. You don't have to go find out what they turn in. You know what what, what they turn in at the end of the week. What am I you paying? Know. I don't know. You, you know what three it is. Hours. Whether okay. it took him an hour or whether it took him four hours. Right. You know. Okay. Mm-hmm. It's also the guys love it. They really do love it. You ask guys they want to change what they're doing. No, no, guys don't like change. But yeah. guys love piece rate because right. uh, that's truly how a guy can do six figures and better in, in residential service plumbing without having to work 80 hours a week. Right. guy can get paid 80 hours and only work 40. Mm-hmm. Okay? It's All right? Beautiful. Okay? So it, it's a beautiful thing. Mm-hmm. Saw it time and time again. Mm-hmm. The guys that don't want to work piece rate, you don't want those guys anyways. You don't want them. All right? They're, yep. they're screwing you. Right. Okay? Um, so piece rate. So I'm assuming you're okay. using piece rate. Okay? okay? Mm-hmm. I'm also assuming that you're charging your customers flat rate. Toby's right, no mot- motivation or hourly or incentive to make more. He's right. exactly right. Right, it's mm-hmm. fair, it's fair. Peace rate's fair to your guys mm-hmm. because it also allows them to give themselves a raise. Right. Mm-hmm. They, get, they get, as they, they, they sell the job, they get, they get the benefit of it, okay? Mm-hmm. And uh, they, they can give themselves a raise. It's also the easiest thing to understand. Yeah, we've okay? got a question from uh, Mark Fidette. Hey, Mark, out of Arizona, if I'm not mistaken. Does commission cause a problem? Y- yeah, it does. Mm-hmm. Um, commission, commission doesn't work. I mean, I'll have guys uh, that will say, you know, that, that it does. It worked for you as a plumbing business owner uh, because you already think as an owner, Okay, when you were in plumbing, if you did very well and worked in another shop as a commission guy, you got that. You got, and there's a reason why you own a plumbing business. Right. You're a little different. Most guys don't understand commission. Mm-hmm. They'll nod their head like they do, but they don't understand it because mm-hmm. you get a percentage of this on this job, but we're going to take away this, this, and this, and all that. And as soon as they hear stuff's being taken away, their mind just drops. Yeah, they don't okay? get it. Mm-hmm. All right, they, they don't get it. Right. All right, it does not incentivify them. Right. You're thinking, well, I'm giving a guy 25%, 30%, I'll, I'll give you 50%. Mm-hmm. It doesn't incentivize them, nope. okay? Guys, what they do understand they is you're going to pay me $30 an hour, mm-hmm. and if I do this, wa- you're going to pay me three hours to do this simple water heater that I do in an hour and a half, mm-hmm. and so you're going to give me the three. If I do an hour and a half, you're going to give me three hours? At thir- yep. Yes, right? Mm-hmm. What, if, what if I do it in two hours? You get three hours. Three hours. Okay. Yep. What if All I right. do it in an hour? Do an hour. You get three, three hours. hours. Jesse's asking, you do pace rate by percentage, right? I was never um, paid by piece rate. Nope, it's not percentage. Not not percentage. Mm-hmm. Okay, they get an hourly rate. Yep. Okay. Mm-hmm. I know, and that's what this is what simplifies it. Yep. And guys are simple. Yep. I get paid twenty five dollars an hour. Mm-hmm. That's my I, I get paid twenty five dollars an that's, hour. That's the hourly rate and, you assign to them. Right. And mm-hmm. then every task that's the beauty of the flat rate mm-hmm. for this water heater. I'm going to sell it for for three hours. So I've sold those hours that time, right? That time for three hours, mm-hmm. okay? And I've also paid the tech three hours. Right. That's the key because you're selling time, mm-hmm. okay? On the tech side, it's very simple. They can add it up. Okay, I get twenty five dollars an hour. I got three hours in this job. My guys love doing dig jobs. I had guys fighting. For the, the the drain camera, mm-hmm. the main camera, because I paid him sixteen hours for a sewer that they didn't have to do. We subbed it out. Right. So my guy got sixteen hours for a new standard sewer, um, whether you know whether we gave a break on it, when we worked on it, you know that you know a, a money break, you know mm-hmm. discount. What I'm trying to say, and he didn't have to do the work. Right. So guy guys were loving it, um, and they'd go do other work. Right. So, so and this goes right into Timothy's question here. Will workers um, slap garbage together just to get to the next job, like use shark bites? No. Well, yeah. I mean, yeah. Bad workers. The wrong will. guys. Guy, guys are bad or bad. You know, guys if, if a guy's going to screw, if a guy's going to do that to you at piece rate, the guy just think what he's doing you on hourly. Right. He's slapping the work together with with shark bites. And then he's taking a but, nap. But he's in the taking truck. all day doing it. Right. <laughs> okay. He's taking a nap in right. the crawl space. And we, we okay. get this question a lot when it comes right. to piece rate. And sure, there's going to be those guys, but you're going to identify it, and then right. you're going to either retrain or okay. you're going to move them on. Right. Because so. they're going to get a call back. Right. Uh, by the way, with piece rate, uh, the no motivation there is they don't get they don't get paid for the callbacks. Right. <laughs> okay. So the guys right. don't want to go back on the work. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. 
Mm-hmm. And again, we're calling guys up. Guys, stop, stop looking at the guys that are screwing you. Stop looking at the hacks, right. the plumbing hacks. Mm-hmm. Okay, start looking for plumbing pros. Mm. Right. Okay, and expecting guys to be plumbing pros and to call them up right. to be plumbing pros. Right. Okay. Yep. Um, Jesse's right. saying very interesting. Seems yep. legit. So Jesse sounds like the first time you're hearing this. Um, we might need to do another it's, show it's a, on Peace Rate. Yep. It's truly the only legit way to to, to uh, pay your guys. Right. And um, to take care, you know, and take care of the customer. Right. Okay. And more importantly, to protect mm-hmm. your business. Yep. Okay. But doing these things then allows you everything is built in to to the job. Okay. So that is able to give you Mm -hmm. the one number, which is HVI, Hourly Value Index, Mm -hmm. okay? That sounds fancy. That's not hours sold or that kind of a thing. Mm -hmm. It's an hourly value index. You've taken all these costs, okay, Mm -hmm. and everything, and you've given it an hourly value, okay? So. This is a beautiful thing, guys. Mm-hmm. Okay, I, there's so much here to go. I can't go deep deep in this program, mm-hmm. but what it allowed you to do, for example, able to run run my my company. Okay, you can run 12, 15 trucks. Okay, with and at that size at that time, um, my hourly value index. What it took to run my business every day to cover all my expenses, my salary, the Laura's salary. All right, you pay yourself. CSRs. Okay, the CSRs, all insurance, the yep. tech, all the overhead, taxes, the taxes, advertising. Taxes. We were doing thirty thousand dollars a month in advertising. Yeah, guys, okay. listen to this. Yellow pages. I know we've said this before, right. but back in the day when we had our plumbing business, you had to be in the yellow pages. You had to be in the big old yellow pages, um, and for Indianapolis, which is a medium-sized market, um, just to be in the big, thick, fat book, it was fifteen thousand dollars. A month, fifteen thousand dollars a month. A month, okay. Guys, think about that. Think, and but that was built into my honest hourly rate. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yep. But my hourly, so I had a number, an HDI number that covered all my expenses. Yep. Okay. Hey, Preston, we will do one piece we'll ratio. It would be great. All right. Mm-hmm. Um, and my hourly value index to run my plumbing business mm-hmm. was six point two. Mm-hmm. Okay, now you may not have reference what that means. Right. Okay, but that, that number was 6.2. What that meant was, to give you an example, my flat rate um, charge to my customer to install a standard water heater, mm-hmm. okay, netted me an HVI of 7.8. Mm-hmm. Okay, so one job, a water heater job, one water heater job covered my company's, all my daily company expenses for, for that day. That's voodoo. One, one job, Food 6.2 cost me to operate daily. Mm-hmm. I won a, a water heater, 7.8. So what is that, 1.6, mm-hmm. okay, over. So when I'm sitting there next to, next to the pool mm-hmm. at Disney World, or our favorite, Jamaica, Okay. Jamaica mom. All right. Sipping on. And I, didn't, I don't sip on anything. I'm, I'm guzzling the. Okay. All right. The mama wana or whatever. Okay. Wait, we have a really good question. Okay. Lance Ball, the Academy. What's that? Yeah. Oh, Jesse. All right. Boy, we. It, it's it's an exciting thing that you need to know about. Yep. Mm-hmm. The Success Academy. Where <laughs> the we success go. Success Academy. We're going to talk about that. the first things that. I go over in first module is, is how to figure out your honest hourly rate. It's okay. the Million Dollar Plumber Success okay. Academy. But then the whole idea, guys, is mm-hmm. you know what my agenda is? What's I want agenda? you guys to be free. Okay. That that's my my agenda. That's the only reason why we, this is what we're all about. This is why to me that I'm ner- I'm nervous about this because this is what I want you guys to get. Everything you're being taught is you don't need. Mm-hmm. You don't, just don't need it. You don't need it. All this, all this information that's being thrown at you with mm-hmm. your stuff and all that, and what your percentage and closing rate and average take it all. That's just fun. Okay, it's it's fun. All right, but it doesn't tell <laughs> you if you're making money. Fun. It doesn't tell you right now. Mm-hmm. Am I going to make payroll? Right. Okay. It doesn't tell you that. Right. Without spending all day figuring this stuff out, and you do spend all day figuring it out, yes. and then still it's not clear because all your expenses really aren't entered into it. Mm-hmm. Okay. So that, you know, and so mm-hmm. it's not that these things aren't important. What will happen is, is all of a sudden you'll you'll see the relationship, okay? Mm-hmm. And you're going to still check your P and L, your profit and loss statement. That's just that's just wise to do mm-hmm. to see how you're coming. You're going, oh, okay, I'm 
I'm running my labor at 24%. Okay, my average ticket, average ticket's fun. Okay, I can see my average ticket is, is fun. you know, is, is $676. Mm-hmm. But let's try to get up to 750. So you, 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 get, you get you guys training on how to, you know, sell more. Okay, right. but really, and that all leads to, by the way, too, uh, that's another thing I took off the guys with my, you know, you get your leaderboards and all that. How many guys you worked at companies or do it in your own company where you talk to your guys about sales? Your, your truck needs to sell sixteen hundred dollars a day, or you know Johnny's done you know ten thousand this week, and that all the guys here. Now you may not have heard this when you worked at the other company because again, there's a reason why you're the plumbing business owner, okay? Right. But all the other guys here is all you want me to do is make you more money. <laughs> all you're doing, like, I know you, your whole house is full of money, and you and Laura just swim around <laughs> in the money. You're throwing the money up, and you're laughing at us, you know. Okay, they make it all about money, and it doesn't drive them. Okay, right. as soon as I took sales off my my leaderboard, mm-hmm. and I made it time, mm-hmm. HVI, all of a sudden the guys got competitive. Right, because mm-hmm. they didn't equate HVI to making money. Mm-hmm. Now I knew what it meant. Okay, so I could equate it to it. So I was kind of a little giggling mm-hmm. behind the scenes, knowing I'm getting what I want from the guys now. Mm-hmm. Okay, but they didn't equate it to money. Yep. Okay, does that make sense? It totally makes sense. Okay. Um, too, um, Toby's got a good comment, but also um, I wanted to respond back to Jesse about the academy. Jesse, just type in the word success yeah. in the comments and you can get all the information about and the academy. And you have to type it in again because yep. Facebook wants you to type yeah. it again and you'll take it and you can get more information about the academy. Right. There's a 14 day free trial. We do have a 14 day So, yeah, I do charge you something for it eventually, uh, but it's worth it. Re- it'll hook you. Okay, right. if you're serious about wanting to know these kinds of things right. and you want to live a freedom, freedom lifestyle lifestyle that's okay? exactly right if you're looking to have a freedom lifestyle mm-hmm. and your plumbing business can provide you that mm-hmm. okay hey Hello. mark Fidette says i love being at the top of those boards that's why you own your own plumbing that's business. why you own your own exactly. plumbing business right <laughs> but all all the other cats mm-hmm. and i should tell you dogs they're pack dogs mm-hmm. okay and i'm not saying i love plumbers okay this is what i mean i love but there's plumbers and you need good plumbers working for you of course but they're just they're just plumbers working for you Hey, and Daniel. so when you're when you're throwing numbers, all these companies that are doing all this stuff with you're selling ten thousand and this and that, you know the guys they're smiling because and looking at your way, the ones that are looking your way, you know and whatever. But it's because you signed their paycheck. Mm-hmm. But in their head they're going, yeah, whatever. yeah. He just wants me to make him more money, right, jerk. Yeah, that, that's what they're <laughs> thinking. Okay, as soon as you make it about mm-hmm. time, okay, mm-hmm. and, and selling time and that kind of focus mm-hmm. and taking care of Mrs. Jones. All right. Right. The, I, the capture the guys, the, the yeah. basic guys. I'm talking the, the average, right. and that's how that's how you grow your plumbing business is right. by br- bringing that whole team, making the average a little greater, or the hey, average guy a little better. Yes, okay? Jesse. Jesse's got some great questions tonight. If I can keep up, they get you give bonuses to those who give good numbers. Nope. Nope. No we bonuses. play little games on on their HVI. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, at the week, you know, the, who had the better HVI, give a hundred dollar bonus. Mm-hmm. And it was that was cheap. That was cheap, just to have something, right. but not the idea of bonus to driving. You want no. the guys that will drive themselves. Right. That's the beauty of piece rate. Right. I mean, I had guys making uh, 15, 20 hour days, mm-hmm. and they're home by five thirty. Right. You, that you want you want those guys on your team. You mm-hmm. want to call those guys up. Right. Okay. Um, not when you got a bonus. You know that, that that sticking at the bonus that doesn't mean anything. Mm-hmm. The, the guys that you got to do that kind of stuff. Right. And then, then again, you spend your whole time bonusing guys, mm-hmm. and it goes and it's never enough. Right. Okay, it's it's never enough. They'll look for it more. Okay. Right. Um, for David more. Um, Velot Velot. Sorry, David. I'm not probably not pronouncing that correctly. And David, where are you from? I don't know if we've seen you comment before. Um, mm-hmm. You also train on how to get more calls coming in. Always the biggest <laughs> um, frustration, right? Right. So that and hiring, right? right? Sure do. That's mm-hmm. that's all in the academy. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, on that, since you're asking, look. Thanks, Lance. And I'm, I'm going to say, David, mm-hmm. look, um, I, again, there's no agenda here other than I want you to be successful. Right. Okay. I'm also decided I'm going to talk straight and real with you. Mm-hmm. Okay. It doesn't matter how much your phone rings. It yep. doesn't matter how much your phone Louisiana. rings if you don't know why you're charging what you're charging. Uh, if you don't know so your true. honest hourly rate, mm-hmm. it don't matter. It okay, don't matter. if you're not paying correctly, mm-hmm. it don't matter. Right. Okay, if you're not charging your customer correctly, it don't matter. Nope. Okay. You can get the phone ringing off the hook. All right, and it's all relative. But. There's also there's also a frame of mind, mm-hmm. a way to look at it as well, mm-hmm. because okay, right now you may need you know I I need five calls a day. 
Well, as soon as you get more guys and you're, you're growing, mm-hmm. now you need 10 calls a day. It's, it's always relative. And right. if, it, if it's always looking for, I need more calls, mm-hmm. I need more calls, I need more calls, there's never enough calls. Right. Okay, so it's having the right things in place. Okay, a lot of guys mm-hmm. wanna go right to, you know, how do I make the, the phone ring more? In fact, right. that's one of the modules. Mm-hmm. Quite honestly, um, in, the, in the academy, making the phone ring, mm-hmm. this kind of stuff isn't until right. module six. Right. Because it's just like there's other things you got to have in place first mm-hmm. to be able to take advantage of the phone ringing. Right. Okay. Just because you know that you're busy, the phone's ringing, and you're going job to job Mm-mm. and working, doesn't mean you're making money. Oh, that's so okay. True. It may feel like you're busy. Right. You know, washing machines, you know, work hard. Right. <laughs> or are busy. Okay. Mm-hmm. But they don't make any money. Mm-hmm. Okay. Nope. All right. Um, Lance has been our cheerleader tonight. Thanks, Lance. With HHR and good guys, you'll be fine when it's slow. Right. It's true. It's it's, it's how it works, okay? Mm-hmm. And so, yeah, check out the Academy. Look, there's, again, there's a 14-day free trial. That's not why I did this this I program know. for, <laughs> um, but but it's been brought up. Look, that's why, I, you know, I'm not ashamed of it. I, I want that for you. It's good, okay? Because right. you don't know this stuff, guys. You don't know it. No. Nope. Okay, you're great plumbers, but no one taught you business. No one taught you this stuff. Right. And your accountant doesn't know how to grow a plumbing business. He does not. He knows how to. He knows how to count these numbers. Right. And but he does not know the, the plumbing business. Right. Okay. Mm-hmm. And so you weren't taught these kinds of things. Right. And until we you until you learn these things, mm-hmm. you're going to be a slave to your business. Mm-hmm. You will constantly have to work in your business, and, and sadly, you'll be like a lot of guys I talk to, where you know they're they're pushing my age. You know, even even younger, your forties, mm-hmm. right. and they got nothing to show for it. Right. Okay, they got nothing to show for it. So, Thanks, but it's Charlie just Bees. like everything's laid out in a way uh, in the academy. Mm-hmm. Uh, just like when you you know, if you're going to plumb a home, mm-hmm. right, Dave? You got you got it. You got your first rough, second what rough, and your your final and, and stuff, and, or your um, your finish. You know, and things in between. You got to do those things in the right order, or it doesn't doesn't work right. Right. right? Same Absolutely. goes. The same principle with your plumbing business. Mm-hmm. So you got to have some things in place first, mm-hmm. okay, uh-huh, uh-huh. so that the you know things like marketing work, okay. Right. Then that will provide you. So you can take advantage of the it. The freedom. Freedom. Okay. Thanks, Lance. Freedom lifestyle. Mm-hmm. Okay. I don't know if you can read that, but that's what it's all about. Okay, right there. Mm-hmm. Okay, not a slave to to your business, not just a job that you own. Right. Okay. But there is a process, and that's kind of the hard thing because um, you know a lot of guys start and they want to know the first thing: how do I make the phone rings, or how do I get new guys on, or, or whatever. But it is a it, if you're if you're in it for the long haul, which right. you should be. With a plumbing, with your plumbing business, burn the ships. I mean, you're, you just, if you decided to start a plumbing business, right? Don't give up. Don't right. stop. Right. You don't. That's that's a key thing, right? Don't stop. Don't stop. And look, you're building the asset. Mm-hmm. It ain't about plumbing. Right. Okay. It it ain't about plumbing. It's not. And you're looking to build this asset, mm-hmm. but you know you can you can build it in a way where you're always answering to it. Mm-hmm. Where you're always answering to it. All these things you're always answering to it. Right. Or you can build it in a way mm-hmm. where it answers to you, okay? And not only does it answer Crazy to you, thought. it gives to you, mm-hmm. all right, in the form of money, <laughs> okay, all right? Wealth, okay, both financial mm-hmm. and time, right? okay? Time is more valuable. Right. Mm-hmm. I didn't, I'll, I'll be, you know, there's, there's other great, um, you know, there's other guys that have been around here and uh, I admire. Um, that are all about are, and are successful, mm-hmm. but they're they're in their business constantly. Yes, they're all about. I mean, they're in it. All right, if they don't, if they're not working on it or, or dealing with an issue, they, they feel lost. Mm-hmm. Okay, I'm not that guy. Not, okay, I'm not that guy. Um, I'm not in my business. I'm on a beach. Right. Okay, sitting half <laughs> naked to the lovely Laura. With the um, palm trees swaying, the blue lo- skies, lo- the surf, okay, and an adult clear. beverage, mm-hmm. okay? That's <laughs> that's my idea of life. Hey, here's okay? um, Elizabeth Fox. Um, her and her husband are a plumbing power couple. Um, master, I almost called it a different name, didn't I? Master Plumbing. Um, she said, MDP has been mm. nothing but amazing growth for us. Follow the process, watch and rewatch them, and you will grow. Thanks, Elizabeth. Thank you for the Appreciate words, Elizabeth. That. Um, and John, John Joseph. Asked, does this process work for HVAC? Um, yes. Yes. Absolutely. I've purposely, you know, mm-hmm. but I've niched it down. Look, mm-hmm. look John, I'm, I'm a master plumber and have mm-hmm. grown you know, a plumbing business. 
go to right. other businesses, but plumbing, plumbing business, mm -hmm. and and been in plumbing for for thirty years. So I mean, I've chosen, and I got a love and a heart for plumbers. Mm -hmm. um, this this works on. In fact, we were you works know works on business any pr business principles. It's right. business principles. We know how to talk plumbing. We right. know how to talk toilets and faucets and and that that's where my heart is. Right. But the same thing goes mm -hmm. with breaking things down by knowing what you're charging, right. you know, per hour, mm -hmm. honestly, ch paying the guy's piece rate, right. all right, mm -hmm. flat rate pricing to, to your customers, okay, and you get everything broken down into that time, time, which gives you that hourly mm -hmm. value index, mm -hmm. okay? So the process, the same thing works, yep. okay? Um, um, one more question here. Timothy says, what about unforeseen circumstances like defective parts and a three-hour job becomes eight? That's a good question. Um, yeah, so I know you want to answer that, but yeah, I think we really need to do have a piece right. rate show. Right. Mm -hmm. but, oh, piece rate show, right. Yeah. Right. Um, but what happens with um, the three-hour job becomes okay. eight? Okay. You know, for, for the time that it does happen, mm -hmm. um, my tech would still give you like a piece rate and it truly wasn't his his fault, mm -hmm. okay, that kind of a thing, as the owner, I would cover him right. for, for that time, right. time times is, you know, is hour. It just doesn't happen very often. And it we doesn't happen. Happens. You can't, again, it's on how you look at things, guys. Mm -hmm. don't, don't look at, well, what if, what if the sky falls? We're all going to die. Don't buy into the coronavirus virus <laughs> thing, guys. That's, don't, 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 do, don't do take it. that same thing with your business, mm -hmm. okay, where, every, you know, every customer, what if this customer screws me? What if this guy does this? Mm -hmm. what, what if this happens? You know, what, what if that happens? What if the parts don't fit? What if the, uh, what, if, what if it's behind the wall? My thing was, uh, the guy's like, what, what if there's a white cat in the window? <laughs> what if there's a white cat in the window? What if there's a white cat in the window? And it was like, the guys go, what? What do you mean by that? That's what the guys, you know, is what they're saying. What if, what if, what it doesn't, what if, guys, if, it doesn't if. happen. Mm -hmm. Life, you know, everything isn't that bad, okay? Mm -hmm. And so when it does go south, now I, now I can tell you mm -hmm. what you want with this builds piece rate, mm -hmm. this, is what I, what, this is what I'm proud of. Mm -hmm. Time and material doesn't do this, Thanks. and on all commission was, don't do this, mm -hmm. okay? I had a job pay, paying piece rate. Okay. Got a guy out, he sold, sold the job, okay? And he gets, you know, he's, he practically makes a week's pay, you know, on a two-day um, board job. Okay. That he wasn't boring, right. okay? We subbed we, it out. We sub it all out, mm -hmm. okay? Okay. But because we teach, part of the culture is you're responsible for everything, mm -hmm. okay? And he's in peace for he's just responsible for everything. And this is the average tech. This wasn't a guy who's going to have his own business. Uh, this was not a yep. star player. Mm -hmm. This wasn't okay. An average plumber. Right. Okay. Okay. The board job goes to hell in a handbasket. What the boring <laughs> company wound up coming through ooh, and wound ooh, up half ooh. the the other one half of the house lines all underneath. You know, mm -hmm. got got tied up. Okay. Mm. Here, my okay. guy took it upon himself. Mm -hmm. Okay. My guy took it upon himself. I, we didn't even know it. I didn't even know this was going on. Okay. okay, didn't even know this was going on. This is on a Friday. We don't work weekends, by the way. We do not. He talks to the customer, uses our company card. Every, every guy had a card I used to buy gas and extra materials with and that kind of stuff, mm -hmm. okay? Puts the family up in a nice hotel. Not, 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 not the Knights Inn <laughs> or the Red Roof Inn, but, you know, like a four-star hotel, mm -hmm. okay? Buys them dinner. Gets, gets them dinner, mm -hmm. okay? Works it with, with the board crew to come back the next day on a Saturday, a day he didn't normally work. Right. Okay. And, and to take care of the problem. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. I didn't find out about this issue until Saturday afternoon. Mm -hmm. uh, that mm -hmm. there was any kind of, when I found out someone's out, Joe's out working, I forget who it was. Right. Uh, I was out, what, what's he out working? <laughs> well, what's going on? Why do I, why do I have a guy out? Because mm -hmm. I don't like having a guy. There's one reason I don't like working weekends and after hours because when your guys are out, I'm out. You right. know, you're out. You know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? Right. And I want my guys to be not out. I, I want to be, be with up. the families and stuff. Mm -hmm. So why, why are we doing, what's he doing out working? Okay. Mm -hmm. um, and so that's when I found out about it. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, it dug into his time. Okay. Mm -hmm. Even though I, did, I didn't, you know, we, we didn't lose money. Mm -hmm. We spent more money. Right. Okay. I wound up paying him his hours for the Saturday that he worked on top of the hours I gave him. Mm -hmm. you, you see what I'm saying? Because so he took the, care of the customer. Because he took care of the customer. Right. Always make it about the customer. Right. And you'll win every time. Right. So on my Monday morning meetings, which you need to have meetings with you guys, I wasn't talking, you know, what your call percentage is and time percentage and get your average ticket up and here's what we're going to do, and just to the guys, just shut up, okay? I mean, yeah, just, they, you know, and right. I can see the bubble. Shut up, <laughs> shut up, shut up, mm -hmm. okay? Along with other words right. okay mm -hmm. it was Choice just words. i just take care of mr jones mm -hmm. okay options 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 make good job notes right stock and clean your trucks mm -hmm. that, that was it that was the focus for 18 years yep 
always. Mm -hmm. And so you build that kind of culture and you have guys, you attract guys, you make it easy for them. First of all, you know what truly what your, what your costs are mm -hmm. and where you stand. So it's easy to make decisions, okay? Um, paying the guys, they give themselves, you know, they're driven, truly driven. They know where they stand. Mm -hmm. Make it clear for the customer. Flat rate pricing is the fairest way to charge your customer. Mm -hmm. You're ripping your customer off. You're, you're charging time material, and you're confusing uh, them. We did yep. that this show ago. Yeah, or to, yep. If you right. missed that, that was two days ago. Right. That show was a great show um, on that. Um, Jesse's asking, so paying piece rate is all 1099? Nope. W two, right? They're employees. It's your employee. So <laughs> employees, yes. right? Okay, Jesse and all you other guys who are asking about piece rate, we will have a show this month on piece rate and go over all that because those are, are really right. good questions. Because piece rate is kind of outside the box thinking, but it's so awesome. Right. So yeah, we'll we'll definitely do that. Um, and I see John wants to know. John Joseph is asking um, Works Plumbing. Um, heard the pos podcast with Works Plumbing. Is rebranding worth it? Yes. Yes. And John, pay attention because we'll be having um, the the company that did Works Plumbing rebranding. We'll have them on the show this month as well. So, rebranding is definitely worth it. Def, okay, def, that's definitely. whole other thing. All those things, by the way, are covered in the Success Academy. It is okay. Mm -hmm. All of it. Um, all right. So type success or type. go to the million dollar plumber .com forward slash success. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. More information there. Look, I'm not looking to handcuff you or, or push you into something. No. All right. If you're, if you're truly serious about, about wanting to grow your plumbing business right. in a, in a be free. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. The, the hat to create a life, a freedom lifestyle, Thanks, TK. you know, for you and your family and to create wealth and security for you and your family. Mm -hmm. All right. And know, know these things. I, 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 te I teach it all to you in the Success Academy. It's all I laid do. out there, all easy bite-sized modules mm -hmm. in the order you need to know and understand these things. I understand mm -hmm. you're also probably very busy. It's tough. And I, I again, just like I figured out the HVI, mm -hmm. I did this for me mm -hmm. I, because I, I wanted an easy, I didn't want to know after the fact. And I didn't want to know, I just wanted to know, am I making money, okay? Right. Am I surviving right now? Okay, am I, so, anyway, and at <laughs> that time it was, am I surviving? <laughs> <laughs> I need, are we gonna make payroll? Do I, am I making payroll? I know we just did the tank list, but I'm not going to make right, payroll. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. This just made it so freeing because I knew exactly where I was at. Right. I did the same thing with the Academy. Look, I'm not, again, I, I'm ATV. not the sharpest tool, you know, in the shed. So mm -hmm. I, to have all this, to learn all this new information all at one time, look, you didn't learn plumbing all in one day, did you? Nope. Or in 30 days? Nope. No. Business, mm -hmm. which is, there's a lot there. Mm -hmm. Okay. What you need to know for your plumbing business to be successful and more importantly, to have a freedom lifestyle, to be mm -hmm. free, okay? Yeah. You're not gonna learn in 30 days. You're not. There's a lot of information there, and it can mm -hmm. be overwhelming. So I've laid it out, laid it out for you, mm -hmm. so it's easy for you to consume. Mm -hmm. It's all there, everything you need to know to have a successful, self-sustaining, yep. okay, and profitable plumbing business, mm -hmm. okay? Type success in the comments. Type success in the okay. comments, and then, yep, it'll, uh, you'll get a messenger message, Facebook messenger message from the Million Dollar Plumber. I think it'll ask you to type success again, just because Facebook wants to confirm you're a human, right? Yep. And then you get a little link and bada boom, bada bing, it's that. This easy. is my, look, my, my, my agenda is I want you, if for those that want it, I wanna show you how you can have a freedom lifestyle. Mm -hmm. How you can much rather be fishing, um, camping with the family, mm -hmm. um, traveling, get an RV and, and travel and run your business, running you know, an RV, uh, driving around the country. Literally, yeah. I mean, if that, that's what you're into. Mm -hmm. Or you'd be like my, my family. We, we up and moved to Costa Rica. We did. And, and ran a plumbing business from Costa Rica. And Can I'm not saying see? sitting in Costa Rica while everyone's out having fun and I'm sitting there, you know, having to be at the computer and all right. that. I'm talking about taking five minutes mm -hmm. to, to figure out, you know, am I making money? Right. Okay. Checking in with the, with the right, office, David. you know, once, you know, mm -hmm. every, every other day, mm -hmm. you know, everything okay? Everything all right. Good. That, that kind of moving on and moving on, right? Mm -hmm. it, it's a beautiful life, guys. Yep. That's my. I want you guys to be, you know, freedom lifestyle. And this is my my thing, the HVI, because mm -hmm. I know it's it's the key. You geek I, out on that. I geek out because sure. I see so many guys get caught up, and I'm in my heart. I just and HGB. I don't want to put others down that are teaching this stuff. Mm -hmm. But it doesn't. It, tell, it don't matter. Right. It don't matter. It don't tell you. It's just it's a game that you get all worked up and play. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm gonna get my closing percentage up. I'm gonna get my closing percentage up. Yeah, where's my closing percentage? Mm -hmm. My average ticket. My average ticket. All right. Mm -hmm. my, my my materials percentage rate. Okay, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the loving Lord is looking at me like, <laughs> like, okay, you're going off the deep end. <laughs> because guys, we get all focused on that, and mm -hmm. it will not tell you if you're making money. Mm -hmm. And it it just doesn't. You get, we get we get lost in that, 
instead of knowing right now, am I making money? Okay. And just just take care of Mrs. Jones. <laughs> you know? Um, Charlie's saying all the go- golf courses that you can play. Yes, that too. Whatever that too. whatever is freedom to you. Right. Right. Okay. Mm-hmm. Imagine how nice it'd be, you know, in between, you know, you know, at the uh, the ninth hole, after the ninth hole, mm-hmm. you know, taking a little break. Mm-hmm. Just chuck in. You know, it's, it's, well, it's you know, it's, lo- it's 11, 11 o'clock in the morning and mm-hmm. And you know that your 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 uh, HVI for the day is six point two, but you're sitting at ten point two. Mm-hmm. All right, uh-huh. Dr- drinks for everyone. <laughs> you know, you're, you're buying all the drinks. Uh-huh. Okay. Hey, Daniel wants to know if the Success Academy teaches how to work with property management companies or home advisor. Um, it, t- it teaches you not to. Right. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you're a dead man plumbing if you're working with uh, property management companies mm-hmm. and a home advisor. Sorry, Daniel. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, yep. Yep. <laughs> and Charlie's got tea time tomorrow at 11. Okay. On All that right. Note. There we go. That's a good one. <laughs> <laughs> I love Charlie B's. Charlie knows his honest hourly rate. He does. Okay. Yeah, he he does. understands piece rate. Mm-hmm. He does. And he's charging flat rate. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yep. All right. And that's why he is a, has a tea time at 11 on a work day tomorrow. That's a beautiful Charlie thing. Jesus right, Charlie? Life. Okay. Love that. All right. Is that there, it, there we have it. I love that. I could go on. You know, I know. I want you, there's a lot here. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. But mm-hmm. if you want to know more about this <laughs> and all these other things, okay, how to work for Home Advisor for the time being, how to handle a management company, yes. Right. Ultimately, I'm going to tell you um, not to. And you'll hear those things in the Success Academy, yes. okay? Mm-hmm. It's all laid out there for you, okay, yes. in the Success Academy. It is. All right. Mm-hmm. Yep. Modules. Like, there we go. Got a little there promo is. there, okay? A little promo. All Look right, 75 that. over 75 Actually, hours, more like 100 hours set. of instruction. 12 power pack modules right there, everything. Mm-hmm. All the business forms you need. If there's flat rate book, have your own flat rate pricing key. Yes. Your honest, how to help you figure out your honest hourly rate. So just right there. There's there. group coaching, mm-hmm. okay? Exclusive community. Live group coaching. Yep, live mm-hmm. group coaching. Teaching the business. Yes. That's the key word, the business of plumbing. Mm-hmm. Okay, and you can try it out for free. 14-day free trial. Just to, I'm, I'm trying to make it so easy for you, okay? There's no excuses, okay? All right? Simply type success in the comments or go to mm-hmm. themilliondollarplumber.com forward slash success. Do it. Do it, okay? If you're serious about growing, you want that freedom lifestyle. Why wouldn't you? Okay? Be? Hey, it was great having you on board here. Hey, we'll do the Peace Rate thing. We will. We'll do the Peace Rate show this month. But you were purposely wonderfully created. You were created to do great things. Yeah. Come like a champion. Thank you for tuning in to Potty Talk Live with Richard Bainey, the Million Dollar Plumber. If you enjoyed this show, share it now. To catch past episodes and get alerts for new episodes, type 5 in the comment section now. Just do it. And join us again for more tips, techniques, and strategies to help you grow your plumbing business.